I liked the makeup of the werewolf, and there were certain scenes that I thought were pretty effective. I remember the first time I saw this movie when they did the scene where the dog freaks out and then runs off into the woods to go investigate what's going on. This is one smart German shepherd. I know. I said that in the beginning of the movie, and somebody's like, no, it's just instinct. I'm like, no, that dog is smarter. Sorry. And then by the end, when I think it's we the saw scene jump that the you're fence. talking about, well, and the handcuffs, and he's like, oh, crap. Yeah. And he turns around. Like, that's a smart But the dog. first time, the Michael Paré character, Uncle Ted, is going off into the woods. He claims he's jogging so he can wear this suit that he can strip out of easily. And he takes this massive pair of handcuffs that he uses to cuff himself to a tree. And there's a scene where the dog comes across this werewolf handcuffed to a tree. And it's like clawing at the tree and thrashing around and howling. And, and the first time I saw that, it really disturbed me because it was the juxtaposition of this feral, ferocious creature, but it was restrained. It was held in check. You know what I mean? I mean, something about that whole thing, the the idea of the the werewolf, which symbolizes this unmitigated sexual ferocity and the restraint, (laughs) the restraint of the animal, the beast, the caged animal that really touched me on a deep level. You got sexually touched by a werewolf? (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? There was I think no, you no. had us until you said sexual ferocity. If you no. just said ferocity. Werewolves, for the most part, when they're used in a film, they represent a sort of sexual state. They always represent a liberation of freedom and animalistic. Why does it have to be sexual? I can't... It always is. If, think of a werewolf movie other than Teen Wolf that doesn't have... Actually, even Teen, Teen Wolf. Wolf. Teen Wolf Puberty. did have the uh, yeah. seven minutes in heaven scene yeah. where she came out with her bra with the claws on it. And he was always more smooth and and more of a, a ladies man when he was in the wolf outfit. And I will give you Teen Wolf. I'm not going to give you Bad Moon Rising. I'm not going <laughs> to give you this one. 